Gutenberg is a live editor that lets you create posts and pages through the use of blocks of content that can easily be moved around or reused in other places. The top of the editor contains a toolbar for creating new content blocks, undoing and redoing, seeing information about your document, and providing an outline slash navigation for all your current blocks. Selecting an existing block will pop up a toolbar with formatting settings for that specific kind of content. Notice that you have different formatting settings depending on the type of block that you select. This is because blocks only hold one type of content per block, making it easier to stylize each part of your document. Depending on your current theme, you may have more or less options than seen here. All blocks will have the same options menu for performing the actions seen here on that block. If your block settings aren't already showing, click Show Block Settings. This will bring up additional settings that are specific to that block type. You can create a new block a number of ways. Clicking the Add Block icon in the toolbar will create a new block at the bottom of the page. Use the Options menu on a block to insert a new one before or after that content. Alternatively, you can hover over a block and use the Add Block option that appears. The quickest and most fluid way though is simply pressing Return or Enter while in another block. This will automatically become a new paragraph block that you can begin writing in. If you want to change the block type, click the icon to the left of the block, where you can choose or search through all your different block types. Your theme may have additional types than the ones seen here, so be sure to check those out. I already know I want to add an image, so instead of searching through the block menu, I can simply type forward slash, which brings up a quick search, and type image and enter. I can then add my image as I normally would. Gutenberg has a ton of different block types and features, but is still very intuitive. I suggest experimenting with all the different options and seeing what you can create. 